really damaged. <laughs> no electricity. No water. Is this a project for us? Could you do it? Could you turn this place into a cozy nice cottage? cottage? Yeah. We bought the cabin and took on the challenge. In 32 working days from now, our family is coming to spend the summer holidays here and the cabin needs to be ready. As the month of May dawns, we begin a new chapter in our cabin's restoration. The roof now securely in place, our attention turns to the floors below. With 18 working days left before we call this place our home for the summer, Julian's ambitious goal of making the cabin livable by June is our driving force. We imagine an unforgettable summer here, filled with laughter and memories with our family. Now we're in the final week before we need to move into the cabin.
With determination and hard work, we have succeeded in creating a home where there was only a shell. Our family has arrived to spend the summer in this beautiful place, and we couldn't be more thrilled. Now, as we make ourselves at home, we embark on a new journey of building and creating, all while embracing the simplicity of life without electricity and running water. With the sun as our source of power, we harness the energy of the solar panels to charge batteries for our adventures. A fridge hums to keep our food and drinks cool, and the river runs nearby, providing us with all the water we need. The summer becomes a workation like no other as we balance the joys of living off the grid with the comforts of some modern conveniences. Day by day, our cabin becomes more and more like a home. As the leaves fall and the days grow shorter, we turn our attention to preparing for the winter. Time is of the essence as we work tirelessly to insulate and seal the remaining walls, ensuring that our home will be able to withstand the harsh winter temperatures. With every step we take, we get closer to our goal of being able to live in this cabin all year round, without the fear of freezing to death. Now, with a few precious weekends available before winter arrives, we do what we can to ensure that our new second home will be ready for the cold months ahead. When we first set out on this journey, we could not have imagined the twists and turns that lay ahead. With only Julian having prior experience in building and renovating, we embarked on a wild adventure, tearing down the old and building up the new with love and patience. It has been a journey of discovery and one that has taught us that anything is possible. As we sit here now in front of a warm fire under the roof that we laid with our own hands, we are filled with a sense of pride and accomplishment. And if we can do this, we know that you can too. Go after your dreams, embrace the unknown, and see where it takes you. It may lead you to a place as wonderful as this. As we look around the cabin, it is clear that our work is not yet done. But we invite you to join us on the journey to follow along as we continue to bring this place to life. The future holds exciting projects such as building walls in the living room, infusing color with paint or wallpaper, and creating a paradise garden and spa outside. If you enjoyed this video, we invite you to explore more of our content, where you can see the restoration process day by day, hear us talk about the challenges we faced, the lessons we learned, and see step by step how we brought this cabin back to life. We hope you will join us on this journey and continue to follow our progress as we make this cabin a true home. Thank you so much for watching.